Hello everybody and welcome back to Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord the General Campaign. So I was just doing some smithing and things were actually going really well. I got everything smelted down and I was in the process of converting this over to fine steel. I just got the raw iron done into iron and was getting ready to start the iron when the Western Empire decided to declare war. That was cool. Unfortunately, my guys were once again pulled into somebody else's group. I had to immediately pull them out of the group. So I had to send 50 influence and take a minor hit. However, that was definitely worth it. So we are going to go meet up with them. And now we are going to go for our next target. I have no clue where they're at right now. I'm hoping that they're over here. So I'm going to try to get closer to them. Yep, there it one. And two, and now we gotta try to go get a town. So now we have to decide. Oh, wait, wait the Kuzite? Yeah, the Kuzite still took that. So the best choice, I think, is still going to be Xeon. Hey, leave that caravan alone. What do you think you're doing, dude? Leave that caravan. Oh, also, I did get some tier fives. These two guys down here are tier fives. And you can easily move these. These won't move. If you try to move them, they won't move. However, if you want to bring something down to the bottom, like I'll show you this guy here, all you do is go ahead and move him to the dismiss, and then bring him back, and boom, he's at the bottom. So I moved the two tier fives down to the bottom. So people said there's a rare chance you can get them, so I figured I would just throw a couple down there. We are great on troops right now. We're good on food. We are good on everything. So we are set. And we are going to get into a big battle. That I will guarantee you. There is going to be something that's going to hit. That is a guarantee. Don't go in there. Because it's going to happen right now. We just need to watch, because what we don't need to do is get overwhelmed. Now, I do have some troops in reserve ready to go. I, I, dev, I have that. Here they come. 900, 1,000. Key. Okay. So, we are going to have to pull additional troops. What I do is this. This is something really smart you can do. As you can see, I have troops ready to go. And why do I do that? Just for this instance right here. Now that they're coming in, I will go over my max limit and pull all these guys in that are waiting to go just to help me out a little bit more. Um, this will be an easier fight because it's the Empire. So I'm 620. So about a 2 to 1 battle. Um, we did good because we got to them before these guys could. If these guys joined up, then it would be pretty crazy. They'd be pushing closer to 50, over 1500. So I'll definitely take this because it's the Empire. And the Empire doesn't scare me like the Kuzites do. The Kuzites are just scary. With all their uh, horsemen. Okay, I gotta remember again now. Alright, first things first. We don't have as much space to work with because of this map, so we got to be really careful with this map because they're going to come right up over that hill, so we do not get as much room. But as you can see, they have hardly no cap, so it's not a concern. I would love to reposition if possible. No, I think I'm going to stay where I'm at. I don't want to take any chances right now. 
And here they come up over the hill. There they are. You guys get the heck away. What was that? Seriously, what was that? I have absolutely no freaking clue what just happened. Thankfully, our guys are staying in there. I, I'm, I'm, I, I don't know what happened. It, it must. The only thing I could think is a crossbow headshot. It's the only thing I can guess. The really good news is we've stayed in this formation. However, I don't like the fact that my infantry are just up. Oh, now they're starting to move. That worries me. I mean, I don't know what happened. Now we're starting to lose. This is what gets worrisome. When the AI is now taking over. That looks like my infantry. That is my inventory just standing there doing nothing. I'd love an explanation on that. Yeah, that's my inventory doing absolutely nothing. Good, at least they're pulling back. Maybe they'll come into my inventory. Yeah, my inventory's not doing anything. Look at that. It's like they're just holding position. They're just tearing up my cab. Luckily, I got a nice wall here, as you can see. holding our own but I'm worried they're gonna hold position again that's good if they good let them go I don't know what happened to our archers I'm worried they routed but it looks like we're gonna take it it's the only thing I can think is a massive crossbow to the head That might have actually been the best thing for the infantry to hold and let them come to us. That could have actually saved me. Where if they would have advanced, they could have gotten overrun. But my, I don't know what happened to all my archers. I mean, I just, yeah, it was like I got hit by a, a trebuchet. I have to see how many men I have. Jeez, that was crazy. Uh, 
All right, not too bad. Almost 50 renowned. Everybody goes at the beginning. In relation. 183. I didn't lose that many. Now I'm way over on prisoners. Damn it. Because my guys are, a lot of my guys are injured. So... We need to do that. We have to. For now. That will get some of them. So we're only 21 over. So I am going to... Take them... Just in case to try to give me a little bit more. I'd love to take those heavy calves, but I'm not going to. Yeah, I know I'm over the limit. Hopefully I can recover fast enough that I won't lose that many. Ah, uh, they're forming another army. There's 600. It's 800. Jeez. They already got like a thousand. Look at that. You gotta be kidding me. Six, so just one. I can't do three sixty five. I it all depends on my peons, actually. I got forty nine still too much I need to get up closer because they've got 850 930 a thousand they got 1200 just there not including those I can't take 1200 on they could battle me right here this could be a battle and this might be one I wouldn't mind actually taking a battle right here. Alright, yeah, I wouldn't mind taking this right now. I'm close. I'm back to base. Yeah, this, this is winnable. It'll get rid of some of them. They still have that army over there. And they gave me a good map. All right, we're all set up. If that was the Kuzites, I'd be captured. No doubt. There's, there's not even a question I would have been captured. Because they would have had so many more cabs. You're gone. You're gone.
you're gone. All right, so we took care of them. Looking good. Looking real good. I gotta save my life though. I pretty much got domination done on that one. We only lost 38, so we're good there. Our next clan tier. Troops. And uh no, we didn't hit the clan tier. Good news is I could take them all. I gotta take meat shields. Yeah, I have to. I can't do anything with the looters. Uh, I can't upgrade them. I need a damn castle or town to upgrade them. Can't upgrade them. Alright, so doing good. We're down to 300. But we're still doing good. Here comes the army. If I could just get a little bit more. I want the army to come to me. Um, I need about 500 troops. Come on. I got a plan. Boom. Into town. Maybe I did hit the clan here. Yeah. Okay. Um, we're close. Being able to do it. Nine 
900. We're only at 300. I'm not there yet. I don't feel uncomfortable yet. They don't want to come off of that village. I do not want to fight in a damn village. I'm comfortable enough to take them right now. But I'd rather fight them out in the open. Why they won't come to me, I don't know. Ah, oh, crap. Four forty one against a thousand. Beyonds. Fifty two. And ten pa and palatines. I think I'm good. Down to twenty eight legionnaires, but where are my eight veterans? I need to move my veterans so I can see them. Train. Where the heck? Oh man, I missed him. Damn it. Or do I not have veterans? I guess I don't have any veterans. I think I'm good. I really do. I have to play more general this time, but as long as they give me a decent map, which they didn't. Oh, um, okay. Cavalry, forward, footmen, move! Infantry, forward! Crap, 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 crap. We gotta get right here. Come on, get into position. Whew, it's terrible. Ooh, it's terrible. Ooh, really, 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 really bad. Alright, um, um, horse archers there. I don't like these horse archers though. We gotta take care of, we that's the only thing that I gotta worry about. It's them right there, so I'll call the horse archers with me. Alright, we're good. We are good. I think we're sitting good. Yeah, I like my positioning.
Better get these guys off my frickin' archers. Get off my archers. Took a lot more casualties than I wanted to. These guys, I let them in a little too close. Alright, they didn't do too bad. We got we got good archers left. Oh, you jerk. <sighs> Goodbye. In your face, come here. Goodbye. Come back here. I got something for you. Thank you. Have a good day. And stop again later. Goodbye. That is why I want to make sure I stay alive. I need to stay alive. Hello, hello. Goodbye. Get wrecked. 106 cut damage to your shoulder. Woo, man. That's me just holding off their armies. It's really difficult to do this in Bannerlord compared to Warband. This is tough. I spent this entire episode just trying to wipe out their armies. By the time I get back over to Zayanica, they're probably going to have another army built up. Now, it's not going to be tough, because it's going to be a lot of recruits, but they're still going to have another army. And an army of a thousand recruits is still an army. And look at that. Look how much I'm over. I got to take junk troops just to try not to lose these. Mm -mm. Damn it. I didn't take them. I hit the button. Damn it. Hate it when I do that. Instead of hitting loot, I hit the button to minimize it. I'm going to lose some prisoners because of it. They're going to escape. Damn. Two hundred riding. Okay, you cause twenty percent more battle morale penalty with range kills while mounted and captain bonus captain 
You cause 20% more battle morale penalty with melee. Um, I feel like I do more damage with melee than I do with a bow. So I'm going to choose melee. Oh, sweet, you got 150. Same thing. I think you, even horse archers are going to use that. I definitely want to go melee on them. Mounted accuracy penalty. Ooh, two of them. Well, mounted, you are not mounted. I don't think you are. I don't think Bitter Drought is. I think Bitter Drought's, um... Well, it doesn't matter, because he doesn't get that perk anyways. <sighs> Accuracy. All right, here we go again. They want to attack. They're going to want to take this battle. I am good. Thirty-five and four, so I got thirty-nine. That's forty of them, but that's the problem. My meat shields. I need a little bit of rest time. However, let's add this up. One, two, three. It's only four fifty. Yeah, come get me. Yeah, what are you guys waiting on? Yeah, yeah, I'm real. I'm good. This will be a nice victory. Nice one to cap off the episode. And they gave me a really good map, too. Make sure my horse archers are in good position. You don't really want to have them overlap your your um, archer. So you want to make sure that when you place them, see how I'm placing the last green? I placed the last green right here. That way they don't overlap. God, they gotta change that. I want that, the number. Oh, hello, hey there. Hey guys, how you doing? Boom! Hello, sir. Hello, hello. Goodbye, see ya. <laughs> God, I love that, they're so stupid. They're just idiots. They come in there that to that stupid attack. It's only a matter of time until you develop a strategy to counteract it. I took out what? How many did I take out? Where's me? Oh, I was up at the top. I took out six of them. Six? By myself. Now they're going to run again. Okay, I 
can't stand for this. Yeah, there they go. I got hit. Ooh. I'm like down to nothing. I got one hit and I'm gone. I don't know how the heck they got there. How did that happen? How did they get behind us? Did they spawn back here? I'm a little confused on that. a little bubble over him. Look at that. See that? There was a little bubble. Where's all of our infantry? Where is everybody? Did I just not have that much infantry? God, that was weird. They had archers standing right there. That was really weird. That I'll take. Thank you. Still can't take them. I'm down to 61 freaking troops, 134 injured. Man, I gotta get back to town. Damn it. Get back to town. We gotta rest. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you absolutely joking? I just don't have enough men ready to go. I want to, I, I need to get some men real quick. That's what I'm hoping to do. And then once they start the siege, I might have enough men. You can see I'm already up to 195. So my hope is that they're going to start the siege and as they get down on men, I'm going to hopefully be able to attack them when they're getting low. They're still not sieging it. Jeez, he's 200. They're starving. Look at it.
Okay, here's the question. Can I get them before they get back to town? Now, if I walk right up to them, they'll attack. So, it's going to be in the next episode. But, I'm going to try to attack them. Because they're starving, and this is a thousand-man army. And once they get down to about 500 or so, I can easily take them. I have enough peons now. I'm good. No, 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 upgrade. So, I am going to attempt it. I'm going to follow them, and I'm going to hopefully take them out before they can get back to Zayana, because that's what they're shooting for. So, in the next episode, we are going to follow them, and we want to jump them before they hit Zayanica. It can still be a tough battle. We're really, really low on troops still. These guys just will not uh, get troops. It's just been tough. Of course, these are being burned and everything. So we're, we're, it's a battle, but it's actually good because we're working our medicine. Um, that's what we want to work. We want to get this high up. So it is going good so far. We can always leave if we have to, but that's what our task is going to be. We're, we're definitely going to follow them and try to take them out before the Annika. So I will see you all in the next episode. Take care, and thanks for watching.